Okay, YouTube, today we're going to talk about this Hallmaster truck bed extender. It's supposed to be a great product. Picked it up at Harbor Freight and uh, I bought it so I could uh, help carry some kayak. A kayak that I'm buying that's 11 and a half feet. It's not going to fit very well in this uh, truck bed of mine. So I need something to help uh, at least support it. But. Let's talk about this thing. It's a 52 and a 52 and a third inches long with a 350 pound capacity. It costs $62.99 and it's supposed to be able to uh, extend out about three feet longer for your uh, truck bed. I did take tape measure, but that does seem pretty accurate. Um, I'm not going to say uh, it is or isn't. I have not measured it. Um, basically, it comes uh, in a box, in this box right here. And uh, the only thing you get with it is the packaging and this uh, manual. But it's pretty self explanatory. Um,. Uh, you get this uh, cotter pin to help uh, put it together and then it just slides into your hitch right here and uh, You'll need to supply your own uh, pin As you can see I had a two inch uh, ball uh, Hitch right there that fit just right into that hitch. No issues This thing it is adjustable for your cab but it wants to focus and uh, it, it's got like five uh, different settings you can use I uh, as it sits right now it's too short for my truck and I don't have you know an overly tall truck with a low hitch uh, my hitch I actually have to have a pretty far drop at least a three and a four inch uh, I could have even went three and a half inch on my ball that's right there but th I just don't think this thing is very is worth the $62.99 it might be good but uh, let me uh, show you some of the stuff that I'm noticing just setting it up that's throwing a lot of red flags. As I set it up, as you can see, it doesn't even go as high as uh, my truck bed does. Uh, mind you, it is a little bit of a taller, uh, but only because of the, it's not that much taller than your standard truck bed. For that for modern beds and uh, I've got maybe at least a two to three inch gap right there between where it levels out it can't and I'm at the the tallest adjustment you can get on there the other thing I'm not sure if you're noticing this I mean look at this lean this is supposed to uh, extend your truck Bed so that you can haul stuff that's longer but I don't know I mean it probably might be sturdy but I mean it doesn't fit together very well it's very loose I mean I'm able to wiggle it around way too much so unless it's really strapped down and you level it out with the load it's going to be wobbly. I mean, I would expect some wobble with it being so long, but I don't think it'd be I'd want that much. I mean, I mean, even if it's all the way down, I mean, it just doesn't fit together very well. I mean, it, 
it fits in, but there is such it it fits in, but there is such a gap on here. I mean, come on. It, and all it does is just slide in. All you do is take this. I don't know. I mean, if it's going to be that wobbly, I mean, I can understand, you know, for load, you know, to help support the load, it might be fine, but yeah, that was my first red flag with this. Uh, it was how wobbly it was. Then I noticed the height. Now, I'm going to take this off. Now, I would expect there to be just a little bit of wobble with it, but I mean, look at this. It doesn't even fit. It does not even a really a good two inch fit. I mean, look at that. That is wobbling around so much that if my load, I don't know, I mean, tell me that that's secure. I mean, let me take this out real quick and I'll throw my, my hitch back in. Ow. He doesn't even want to take, let, release the spacer I got. Okay. I mean, I expect a little bit of wiggle. I mean, that's still a pretty good fit. I mean, they seem like they, they are the same size tubes. But, I don't know. It seems like there is a lot of wig, more wiggle than what my hitch that has. In fact, my hitch may just be a hair bit smaller. I understand it's a lot longer, but that fit, for as long as this thing is, the fit on it sucks. I mean, like I said, it may not be that way when you have a load on there. But if this thing's just behind your truck and you're going to pick something up and you're putting it on before you get there, I don't know. I don't think I would trust it behind my truck. This thing is definitely going back. <sighs> this is Midnight Wolf. And this is the Hallmaster 53 and a quarter inch long truck bed extender. I gotta say, give it a pass. Try something else.